Welcome to another UCCS Machine Shop video. Today we will show you how to thread on a lathe. The first step is to trim down your part to the correct diameter specified on your drawing by making multiple passes. Cut a thread relief with the cutting tool. This is where you will have your machine stop threading. Set up the machine to chamfer. Position the tool at the right angle. Mark the part where you need to chamfer. Cut the part using multiple passes. Make sure the machine is in the proper position for your specified threads per inch. Each machine is different, so consult a TA if you do not know how to set the machine. Set the machine to a slow speed to thread your part. In this case, we chose 100 RPMs. Each machine is different, so consult a TA for assistance on setting the machine. Turn on the threading engagement knob on the machine. Set up the threading tool that you will use. Check the height with a fishtail. The fishtail also has a slot on the side where you insert the threading tool and check the alignment of the threading tool. Once the threading tool is set up, align the cutting tool to the thread relief that you made earlier. Make sure the compound slide is all the way forward and the threading handle is engaged in the right direction. Move the thread stop up to the saddle of the lathe and tighten it down with an Allen wrench. It is best if the fine adjustment screw is halfway in like shown in the picture. Next, with the threading tool away from your part, Turn on the machine and check to see if it stops at your thread relief. Finer adjustments may be needed at this point. Each machine has a different threading handle, so consult a TA on your machine. The fishtail has depths for all standard threads. Look for your thread and the number next to it represents the depth that you need to cut. Make multiple passes around 10 thousandths of an inch at a time. Note the process on turning the threads. Running it, backing it out, turning the threading handle, and bringing the saddle back to the start position. Once you cut to the depth specified by the fishtail, do not remove the part. Test your threads using a net with the proper thread size. If it is hard to thread it on, cut off a thousandth at a time until the nut fits nicely without being loose. You can now remove your part. Your part should look like this. Thanks for watching. 